guys and welcome back to another taste test review so we're doing yet another one of these olipop drinks and i'm so excited for this one this is the cherry vanilla which honestly i have high hopes for like it looks like it should be real good this one has five grams of sugar per can so maybe a little sweeter may not have so much of that diet taste but like the others, it uh, supports digestive health, has prebiotics, botanicals, and plant fiber. It's non-GMO. And it says about it. We've spent years crafting a drink that's as good for your digestion as it is delicious. Olipop combines the benefits of prebiotics, plant fiber, and botanicals in a sparkling tonic that supports your microbiome and benefits digestive health. We pinpointed the cherry pie flavor that we were craving with a careful combination of tart morello cherries and the sweet tang of rainier cherries, then rounded things out with the soft and sumptuous taste of vanilla bean. Ooh. So we have more than one cherry going on. So it's vegan, paleo, and gluten-free. Contains 10% juice. Okay, so... The ingredients in this one are purified water, tart cherry juice concentrate, cassava root fiber, chicory root inulin, cassava root syrup, apple juice concentrate, Jerusalem artichoke inulin, lime juice, natural white cherry flavor, kudzu root, marshmallow root, Nepal cactus, slippery elm bark, natural vanilla flavor, calendula flower, reb m stevia, and Himalayan pink salt. Okay, so... Oh, I didn't realize these are made in Oakland. That's another one that's local. How cool. How cool is that? That's literally like 20 minutes from here. So, okay, let's see. Does it have a scent? I can tell from the little bubbles that have bubbled up on the edge from where I opened it that it's light pink in color. Not getting much in the way of a scent. So I guess I'm just going to have to taste it. Whoa. That has a lot of flavor going on all at once. I wasn't expecting quite that much of a bang, like, right out of the gate. Like, wow. Um, oh, that's cool. You can taste the different kind of cherries in that. Like, at different points, they come through, but ooh. It does have that, like, sweet and tart thing going on with it. Oh, that is really good. I think this one's my new favorite now, actually did not disappoint hell yeah like the aftertaste is definitely a sweet one overall so i like that i don't know that i'm getting the vanilla really in it if i am it's like barely there but the interesting thing is somehow out of that flavor set that flavor profile there is almost something very vaguely reminiscent of like pie crust as well that is wild! That is so wild! Oh my god, 5 out of 5. This stuff's amazing! Like I said, new fave. New fave. Would, like, 10 out of 10 buy it again. That is amazingly good. If you like cherry flavors. If you like cherry pie, you will be into this. If you don't like cherries, stay far away from it, because it's straight cherry. And it's, like, legit cherry, not, like, artificial candy cherry. No, 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 no. This is, like, the good kind. So I am blown away on this one, honestly. I didn't expect it to be anywhere near that good, but wow. Mind blown. <laughs> I think I was expecting it to be like really similar to that strawberry vanilla one, but no, 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 no. Miles different. Miles different. So anyway, love it think you will too. So anyway, that's it for this one, guys. So as usual, you know what to do. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe, hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload, leave comments down below. Make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, my eBay, my Reddit, everything and more, it's all down below. And if you like what I do here on this channel and you'd like to help support it, the donation link, as always, is down in the description. Anyway, guys, until next time, see ya.